Join us this week as we put the 80 through more sand and salt than Alex is happy with. Find an airfare campsite. Come on. And catch and cook up a feed. Hit the thumbs up if you like the video and subscribe if you're new here. I'm Bronte and this is Alex. Join us as we go on the search for the best for driving, fishing and surfing in Australia. After our full driving heaven last week, we headed further north to Fleuru Peninsula. And on the way up, there was a unique four driving location that we wanted to check out. pulled up into Karung National Park and we just crossed the tea tree crossing and we just thought we'd give it a crack with our um, normal tyre pressure up this little hill or kind of a big sand dune at like what 40 psi <laughs> no way in hell so we're just putting the tyres down to what 20 we're just putting the tyres down just to get back up there um, but yeah it goes into like all these dunes and stuff so yeah we'll go go have an explore Just. just went through TT. TT? <laughs> we just went through the TT. Yeah, the TT. Through tea tree crossing and um, made our way over to the beach. Pretty cool little setup. It's pretty unique. Feels like you're driving through like Mad Max land, a bit of a sand dune and open plains, and then you um, go through a little bit of scrub onto the beach. There's not a lot down the beach, I guess. It's just like, just the runs all the way up towards Victor Harbour, and then there's a river, and you can't cross the river. We just went down to check it out and have a little look around, and we might poke our heads somewhere else and see what else we can find. I want to know if it's salt. Alex is a bit grumpy because he thinks it's salt. I think, I think it's salt. He's going to have lots of salty cups. Yep. Did salt? Yep, she's salt alright. Ooh, salt under the car. Happy yeah. days. She's an old car. That's lame, eh? That's so lame.
to finding a servo to put the tyre pressure back up and a car wash to clean the salt off the 80. Alex is in the mood for talking again and we still had a fair drive ahead of us before pulling into a camp late at night. last night of dark so we couldn't see what it was like but it's pretty nice we've got our good sourdough isn't it? oh I love sourdough Yeah, we're just gonna go for a little walk up around the corner here to another little bay. Yeah. And um, see what that's like. It's just a beautiful day and it's just great to see this bay in its element. The yeah. winds are good for it and yeah. yeah. This place is so cool. The caravan park's like right on the beach. You can go around this headland to another little beach as well. Like it's so pretty, crystal clear water. The sun out's warm enough, I might need to take my jacket off in a minute. Yeah, I'm hot in my bean. Catch some fish. Yeah. It feels like we're in the Mediterranean right now. It's like all the rocky cliffs with the crystal clear blue water. Oh my gosh. Mediterranean or South Oz? <laughs> Can I put a squid jig on? Yeah, go for it, love. Whoa, 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 whoa. What'd you get? I got a big bloody. Big flooding. You still on? What? What? Oh my god. That's sick. How's that? That's a nice flooding. Yeah. That's it. I saw him come and try to hit my squid jig. Yeah. You could eat him, he's pretty solid. Past my elbow. They'll put him back. This flatty came up and like looked at it and then like kicked away and turned away and I was like, oh that was cool. And then did another car, same thing. He like I like paused it there, he looked at it and then like kicked away and I was like, I'm gonna go put I'm gonna put a little plastic on. Put this on, second cars, tweak tweak, then bang straight on. I'll see it. So we just finished off at Rapid Bay, is that what it's called? Rapid Bay. Rapid Bay. It's a beautiful day, um, it's just super windy down there so we're going to see if we can get a spot um, a little less windy. Um, so we're heading west, northwest, to I think it's called Selix Beach. Norwest? Norwest, yeah. Southwest? No, Norwest. We're heading north-ish. 
Oh, right. Yeah. But yeah, they've got some nice big cliffs and stuff there, so maybe we can be get protected and out of living there, but we'll see how we go. Right it? Right, 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 bay. What the hell did you just say? Right, rapid bay. Right, rapid bay, so that's in time to Right, right, rapid bay. Right, rapid bay, right, rapid bay. Right. Yeah, it's really sick. Sick little bay. It'd be nice to stay there for a couple of nights. So yeah. It's... it's just a bit expensive. It's $30 a night and there's no facilities. It's literally just a grass yeah. campground. There are some public toilets there, but um, it's average. not even part of the campground. So we we'll yeah. see just to save money on the budget. Well, I do a poo in the bush. Yeah, we we'll see if there's some free camping that we can get to. The beach we checked was really windy, but we've pulled up. It's like a little roadside pullover section that we've pulled up to, and it's really, really pretty. And there's no one around, so let me show you. Sun setting. There's a nice little beach like around the corner. The also, how good are my hand gloves? My, Bobby, it, we have soft, they're male size, so I don't really feel my fingers, but they're so good for the gold at night. Um, we're just cooking up some dinner and then we will keep here for the night, eh? Yeah. Alex on chef duty again. Good morning. We officially had the worst night's sleep ever. I don't know if you can hear that with the wind just going all night and the tent at the end shakes. Normally it's fine because we face the wind under the hard shell. But where we are, the wind like hits the mountains and it like swirls around and then it comes back through this side and it shades in like that noise all night. I don't fall asleep until 1.30 when I put my headphones in. How did you sleep, Alex? Oh. Good. There's just been so windy lately, so we're just trying to find somewhere today out of the wind. heading back to Rapid Bay as it was one of the few beaches out of the wind for the day before heading to a hidden gem of a campsite for the night and in the meantime Alex worked on figuring out his broken air pump. She blew. <laughs> she blew her eye. Full melted everything eh. woken up and we've got this secluded little beach all to ourselves in the middle of school holidays it's so nice Alex has just woken up he's trying to catch the salmon that we saw last night oh there they are there they are there they are there they are wow there they are wow they're shooting everywhere Ronnie had to go do something down in the water I had to go have a shower she was just like Alex, there's so many fish here, and I was like, what? Ran down there, and there's just like salmon just swimming around her feet. So cool. 10 grand twisty, little two and a half thousand Daiwa, 10 pound main line. I really want to hook salmon on this tiny setup. Let's see how we go. On the tiny setup. Oh, he's small, but still so sick. Come on, buddy. Let's get a look at ya. Oh, six knots. 
Smoked it. Come on. Oh no. Keep your head down. Keep your head down. Oh, so many rocks here. Oh no. No. Ah. Yeah, dog. Nice little chopper. Australian salmon. You got one. Is he edible? Yeah, but he's not massive. Yeah, I have him for some brunch. He ate it like at the shore, eh? It's so weird. Sick. Fish brekkie. Fish for brekkie. Odd combo. I'm just going to get the fire pit out and maybe grill it on top of that. The heat's kind of low still, so it might take a little bit longer. What flavours you running? Just salt and butter. Nice. I'm hoping these being like a little bit, they're not very big. They might be like really sweet. It's all right for being salmon. Bit of salmon for Bracky. Oh, that one's good for you. It's hot, eh? Mm. It's a little warmish day we've had. Mm. Yeah, that's good. Mm. It's So apparently you can't hook air compressors up to the deep cycle battery as it can't handle the high amp draw from the air compressor. So basically we have to reroute the wire to the start battery, but we can't do this on the beach. We have to wait till we get back in town. Righty sparky mechanic. At least I know for next time. Thanks for watching another video guys. Um, we're about to pack her up and we're heading to Kangaroo Island next week. Join in next week to watch our little trip to Kangaroo Island.